This is Max Weber. I kind of felt this was appropriate. <laughs> um, sorry, I thought that was really funny. I'm going to eat this giant thing. This is a giant pill. I can only swallow one at a time. Even with all this food and everything. I can't swallow pills normally without food or anything anyway. Um, but this is giant and I can barely fit it down my throat. And only one can go down my throat at a time. So. <laughs> yeah, um, these are testosterone support pills. Yeah. My sister, like, bought a bunch of them. And I took some. They don't actually do anything. But I'm gonna take some. Because <laughs> I'm a daily on my testosterone anyways. And I'm gonna have to pick it up today. Probably actually pick up other medication and take it. Yeah. Um. Crap. Can't swallow things. Okay. Apparently I still can't swallow it. Oh. Well. <laughs> Damn it. It hurts the crap out of my throat whenever I swallow them. Oh, this gets lodged in my throat because of how big they are. <sighs> throat is not that large. Can't say because something that's solid and that won't smash down. Right, so, okay. Um. <laughs> now this was fitting. Um, it's so watery. It's just, um, tomato sauce. It's watery because I added water to the jar to get all of the tomato sauce out of it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So these are my other two packets. I took two of them yesterday. Yeah. Um, sorry. <sighs> Off topic. <clears throat> so. Anyway. Oh. You can't really see this so well. Yeah, the random things around my room. <laughs> um, I'm obviously being apparently super random. <clears throat> yeah, anyway, um... Okay, this topic is about the period excuse, which I just call periods bloody curse, because that's what they are. Um, I didn't know anyone else, because apparently it had, took me, like, took me over a year to get a high enough dosage. Well, I'd already been on T for a year, and, and still nothing happened, because apparently... A very high estrogen level. Everyone has estrogen and testosterone in their bodies. Um, you just your body makes more homer, um, more of one of the hormones than the other. That's it. There's no difference in people's makeup at all. Besides the fact that your body produces a little bit more of one hormone than the other one. And that changes your body to present, and so your sex is male or female. That's literally it. Um, but anyway, I don't get, in, like, the period excuse, or, like, the bloody curse excuse, or, like, I'm a man, and, like, I have testosterone, and it does crazy things, and everything like that. No, it doesn't. If you're moody, or if you act like a bitch, you're gonna act like a bitch. No matter what. And honestly, to me, being a bitch has nothing to do if you're male or female. You can be a bitch either way. 
literally you're a bitch if you make fun of if you're like super rude to other people it's the same as being like an asshole you're just super mean and rude to everyone else and you make fun of other one other people for being different and not being exactly like you so and you don't care about other people and you only care about yourself and you do things to hurt other people. Yeah. Um, but yeah, if you're moody, you're moody. Yeah, your body produces blood and it's super painful. And like, pills didn't even work for me at all to help with that. So I was always in a lot of pain. And I never used the excuse because... Like, if you're moody, you're moody. If you're a guy, you're a guy. If you're a girl, you're a girl. <laughs> if you're horny, you're horny. Literally. It doesn't excuse or explain anyone's behavior. If you act badly, you act badly. And that says that you're a crappy person. It says a lot about you. And it has nothing to do with what's happening in your body. There's literally no changes because there are always like warnings and things whenever you're taking any hormone. They're like, this might happen, this might happen. Like, like oh, you might be more angry. Oh, you might, might be more hungry. You might be more horny. Like, all of those things are going to happen on either on and like maybe have mood swings on like either one literally the same symptoms on both ones the only thing that changes is either is like possibly like the amount of hair you grow or fat disfruit um where the fat goes to like where it moves or is it added on So, yeah, I never used that excuse. Um, the only thing that's changed for me is I was already had a large appetite and hungry. So I don't really know if that changed. I might have gotten a little bit more hungry. I don't know. Um, and then I got a little bit more horny, but that was like it. <laughs> yeah. Um, so that's all the changes on... I've had experience with tea and um, the bloody curse excuse. You can use it, but it doesn't make any sense and it's not a valid excuse or anything. Yeah, so that's it. Bye.